set up, and we're using airport to wirelessly play together. Could be two kids in neighboring houses. <laughs> we're going to launch the game. He's running this as a server on his machine, and I'm going to hook up with him wirelessly over airport. He's downloading the maps and information. Here we are, David versus Phil. Now the graphics are just incredibly stunning. Now before I hit play with David, I gotta go make sure I have a few good things. Protection. A few things. Three, Look at this play two, back. One. Fight. Let's go try to find David. Give you a quick look of him. Just amazing performance. Now I have set this on with all of the graphic features turned on. If any of you play Quake, you know I've turned on vertex lighting, 32-bit graphics. <laughs> and David works for me so he knows he won't shoot. <laughs> Just incredible graphics. So this is a kill-free demo. The graphics are amazing. Playing Airport on a Rage 128 wirelessly no one else in the world can offer that. Thank you. So, the new iMac. It's incredible. And we want to make it really affordable. So, just as we were adding all of these new amazing features, which add money, we were also trying to cost reduce our product value engineer it so that we could make it even more affordable. And we, the engineering team did a great job because the new iMac cost But it's even better, because today CompuServe is announcing that their $400 rebate, if you sign up for three years of their service, now applies to all Macintoshes. And so with this rebate, you can get a new iMac for $599. So. The new iMac. We now have the best consumer desktop on the planet. And I really want to thank you for coming here and seeing it with us today. We're really, really proud of it. Everybody's worked really hard on it. So thank you. Oh, wait a minute, though. Wait a minute. I forgot. There is one more thing I forgot to tell you about. This is really important. In addition to the iMac, we have a second model called the iMac DV. What does DV stand for? Digital video. The iMac digital video. What is this? Well, the iMac DV is everything in iMac and a lot more. Let me tell you the more. 400 megahertz processor, even faster. 10 gig drive, even bigger. RGB video out, built into every one. This is a key feature for our education customers. So, sort of on the bottom, headed for the back, there's a little ventilation grill on the bottom. Looks like this. You can pop it out very easily and expose the connector. And we even ship another nice little grill you can pop in, and then you can just hook right onto it. So everybody who needs RGB out, built into every single unit. And you're welcome. <laughs> and now I'd like to tell you about an amazing feature built into every new iMac DV model. 
And that, of course, is Firewire. <laughs> Firewire is an Apple, Apple created technology that's become an industry standard. Firewire runs at 400 megabits per second over this beautiful plug and play, hot pluggable, nice little serial interface. And we've built two of them in, so you can be running both of them simultaneously at 400 megabits per second. Firewire is an industry standard. It's been adopted by every single consumer electronics company and all of the forward-looking computer companies. <laughs> and what we've done is taken that easy access connector plate on the side of the new iMac, and we've taken this area right here, and we've put the two Firewire jacks right there on the new iMacs. So, <clears throat> Firewire devices are taken off just like USB did. By the end of this quarter, there's over going to be 50, over 50 of them shipping, and almost double that announced. All sorts of things like hard disk drives, up to 14 gigabytes that you can just plug into the FireWire port of the iMac. It gets its power off the new iMac, so you don't need any wall transformers. And again, you can daisy chain a whole bunch of these on if you want. So the iMac is now truly expandable from a hard disk and high-speed peripheral point of view with not only USB, but now with FireWire as well. So we think this is a pretty big deal. Now, we also have refined the colors. You might have seen on the Blueberry unit, the Blueberry's a little different because when you can see all the way through the unit, it gives us an opportunity to create even more beautiful colors. And so I'd like you again to join me in welcoming the new iMac DV colors. Let's take a look at it. There's five of them just like before. Tangerine, lime, grape, strawberry, and blueberry. Let's take a look at them. Come on over here and let's take a look at the tangerine. Again, it, they're just luscious. They're so wonderful. Now they're even more translucent than ever, brighter than ever, and uh, you can see all the way through these things. They just almost want to float. And because the iMac's about an inch shorter than it used to be, and it's a little higher in the back, they really do look like a bubble almost. And look at this. Beautiful tangerine. Come on, let's walk down the line. The lime is even lighter than before. It's really beautiful. And again, you can see all the way through these things. The grape is incredible now. It's maybe my favorite. And uh, it's just really luscious. The strawberry. The strawberry is uh, definitely met Barbie. <laughs> and it's really beautiful too. And then, of course, blueberry, same as the iMac we just saw. So five new colors in iMacs refined, even more beautiful than before. iMac DV. <laughs> so, thank you. They're really beautiful. So iMac DV. Well, wait a minute. Where's the DV? Aha, uh -huh. another amazing feature, another amazing feature. The iMac DV models can play movies. And what does that mean? What that means is, is that the new slot load drive in every iMac DV is not a CD-ROM, it is a DVD-ROM drive, so that you can load in you can load in your greatest, latest DVD-ROM games and other software, but it also plays DVD movies. Right out of the same drive, you can just load in your favorite movies. Right? In and out. You load in your favorite movies, and it's incredible. And what it does is, it takes these DVD movies, and it reads them, of course, digitally right off the drive, and digitally sends them right up to the iMac super great quality high resolution display. It's much better than even most DVD players that use NTSC video, some form of S video, even component video. It's all digital, all the way up to the display, and the quality is really stunning. And so what I'd like to do right now, oh, and if you're going to watch movies where you're going to have an iMac, 